For me, uh, personally, tonight's going really, really well. Launch party this evening uh, for Mayfair House, as you can probably tell, packed uh, with, uh, with viewers. Really great response from the locals. Um, I'm really excited about the launch weekend tomorrow. I think quality holds out with a development like this. I think people recognise the, the attention to detail that we've put into it. And I, I think they, they realise that, uh, yeah, as a developer, that we've put in the highest quality finishes uh, possible. And, and of course, it is a, a beautiful listed building, and, uh, and, and the character of that shines through. We are very, very proud of what we've managed to achieve here. It's, it's a fantastic project, and, and the, 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 the feedback we're getting from everybody is, is, is absolutely fantastic. You know, we're really, really proud. To have someone like Robert working on a development like this is absolutely fantastic and I certainly look forward to working with the new managing agents and the residents here of the new apartments to actually make sure what, what we have is a really well managed block going forward in the future. It's obviously brand new here at the moment but actually I really hope that working with Jordan Cook as the managing agents that actually this block remains a lovely place to live and because it's well managed for many years to come. We were aware of the development coming to market about three weeks ago. Um, we made contact direct with the Pure Group, the developer here, um, and uh, pitched for the opportunity to, uh, to, to market the development. We were successful at that point, uh, and the last three weeks have been pretty much a roller coaster. We've advertised in Brighton Hove, London, um, right across Surrey, obviously Worthing, right across the South Coast, and we've had a great response. We've had some clients that have emailed us in from Egypt. Uh, that have seen online activity uh, and are coming down over the weekend. We've had lots of people from Brighton and Hove. Uh, we've got clients uh, from London, Surrey, um, so all walks of life as well, whether it's been professional people, younger buyers or, uh, or retired people as well. It's an excellent turnout. The greater good of the town are here. It's great to see some of members of the Worthing Society who do a huge amount of work holding people like me and my fellow councillors to account, uh, making sure that when we receive planning applications, we get the very best from developers. And that's why I'm hugely proud of the council's relationship with Robert and the developers here at, at, the, at the, Mayf the Mayfair Hotel, because actually what we've created is a really, really good development that the Worthing Society and the council can be very proud of and set a really, really good benchmark for a high standard developments for the future. It's taken three years of my life uh, from concept to completion and my wife said if I ever do another project like this, she would leave me. For me, really, really proud to be involved, um, really, really excited for the launch weekend. Um, for us already, prior to the launch weekend, we've agreed five of the 11 apartments. It's almost 50% gone before we've launched, so we've had a fantastic response. But yeah, really, really exciting times.